Hi there, welcome to Revy Bundles. My name is Jim. Uh, super excited to have you here and wanted to take just a, a couple minutes to help you get things set up according to best practices. So once you're on the screen, the first thing you want to do is, is set your, your initial bundle and you can name it whatever you like here. You'll see if you hover over each of these options an explanation for what they do. So we have standard, quantity and volume, mix and match collection, and mix and match products. So I recommend asking yourself what your initial goal is in using bundles and then setting up um, the one that most meets that goal. For example, if you have a large quantity of something and you're trying to increase the volume of purchase, then you could use this one. If you want to use a standard bundle uh, to increase the you know different products that they would purchase or the likelihood that they would purchase two products together, you can use this one. And for this example, we'll, we'll do the standard bundle. So hit select here. All right, so in this section, you wanna add products. Okay, so in this case, we will bundle the Adidas backpack and you can deselect any that you don't want to include within the bundle, uh, any colors, etc. And then, so let's say in this case, we will bundle the backpack with, um, let's go with these Superstar 80s. So we'll click this as well, and then we'll hit add. Okay, in this section, you can allocate the discount that you want to give, and your choices are percentage, fixed amount off, or a fixed price for the bundle. In this example, we use percentage. So we're saying if they combine these two products, they'll get a certain percentage off. In this case, we'll just say 10%. All right, and this is where you can adjust the text. The default here is certainly fine and, and um, a workable option. You can customize this, and I recommend having fun with this, and you can even use ChatGPT to come up with different ideas on, um, you know, copywriting ideas on uh, the, the way that you can describe the products. You can even give it input as to the, the name and types of products and give it uh, ask it to give you examples. So you would write in whatever you want here for the title, and then also this is the success um, message if they add these products then they get a little positive feedback you know you saved by bundling that kind of thing okay this section is a placements window where they'll decide um, or where you'll decide where the to display the bundle uh, you can see you have several options here your option, options include uh, obviously showing on each of the specific products. So for example, if they land on the backpack, they will also see, well, they'll see the bundle offer with the Superstar 80s and vice versa. You can um, add it to a bundles page, which shows all of the different bundles that are available to your visitors. And then you can embed it in any specific page using this embed code. All right, and then you have this option here, other product pages. Uh, you can see it says shows the bundle on other product pages that are not part of the bundle. And then here's the link to embed it anywhere, um, this actual um, HTML tag that you can add to your theme to display it anywhere. All right, next you have an option to schedule. So this would be relevant to scheduling for specific promotions. Let's say that you're doing you know, like a, a Christmas time bundle and you wanted it set for a specific time or maybe a Black Friday deal and you can set the, the date and time um, to uh, display that just during that specific period. All right, and then the next section here is for custom text. So we set the text earlier, and this is the, the global text that will display on all bundles. If you want to change to set custom text, let's say you have several bundles and you wanna change the uh, text on one specific bundle, this is where you would do that. You would pick the bundle and then uh, change the, the specific text on that bundle as you see fit. All right, when we're done with all that, we're gonna hit save. And from here, you can actually go test it on your live store. So we'll click here, go to product page, and then you can see right here is the bundle. We have the Adidas backpack and the Superstar 80s, uh, and you can see that there's um, a discount there. So you can add that. And then here in the cart, you can see that that discount is applied. From there, let's go back here and click next step after you verify that that is complete. Um, and then this is meant to alert us if you uh, can't see the bundles. In this case, we can. So we have this little <laughs> exciting message here. Okay. Um, and by the way, so we, we're a, a small business and reviews like this mean the world to us. So if you have a couple moments to leave us a review, really appreciate you doing that. Uh, by all means, if this isn't working uh, well for you or you have any concerns, we have a fantastic support team and I'd highly encourage you to reach out and we'll get that resolved quickly. Uh, you can see it just goes over here and you can, um, I'm doing a test store so I can't do so, but you would be able to do that. 
Okay, that's it. You're well on your way. So you can obviously add more bundles and do experiments. I highly suggest adding more than just one. Uh, we found in our research that, uh, and this should go without saying, but the more bundles our um, Shopify merchants add, the more they sell. People, users um, really appreciate bundles and they appreciate getting a discount. So uh, certainly it makes a huge difference in top line revenue. If you need support or help, don't hesitate to reach out here. You can click this button. You can see a lot of different articles that we've created to help you uh, dive further into the app. And then there's obviously the support uh, widget here where you can reach out and have a conversation with us. Uh, thanks so much for your time. Really appreciate it. And uh, congrats on setting up your first bundle. Cheers.